Well, this is just incredible. I just made a video on the other channel about the blood over intent farce craze. And I look on the Irish media tonight and I'm hearing about this thing called ghosting. Now, it's not ghosting like the ghosting where you get rid of someone that's uh, that's trying to play mind games with you and you just block them out of your life. It's, it's the ghosting term is being used for something else. And it's in the same kind of um, grand burlesquing of, say, the Tide Pod channel, challenge and the, uh, the Ice Bucket challenge. But this one is incredibly dangerous. What makes this one interesting? We live in an age where the, 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 the powers that be are constantly burlesquing the population. Like, for instance, with the mask and the social, they, 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 they've got them doing anything. So the average normie is so highly suggestible and stupid. And if you thought, if you thought tide, tide, bads, tide pods are bad enough, let me read this to you. And this is from the journal.ie. Garda, Gardi, that's the Irish police, warn against social media challenge to lie down on road or under a sheet after you'd hospitalised. The public have been warned against taking part in a social media challenge after a woman was hospitalised for a number of days after carrying it out. Ghosting calls on people to lie on a road with a sheet placed over them in an attempt to stop oncoming traffic, Garda said. The activity is extremely irresponsible and poses a serious danger to those taking part in ghosting and motorists, a statement from the Gardaí said. Gardaí highlighted a recent incident in the south of Ireland in which a young female received a number of injuries, minor injuries, while carrying out this trend. Emergency services brought the youth to hospital where she had been treated for injuries sustained to her back, torso and ankle. On Garda Shia Khan are urging people not to engage in a social media trend which they say has been circulating online. Gardaí are particularly appealing to parents to educate their children on the dangers of participating in such activities and the importance of being seen while using Irish roads. This is what the normies are like now. Now, the whole thing of the police telling parents to educate their pe children and not falling for fads, the parents will have a mask on their face, gloves on their hand, probably a visor in front while they're driving, walking around with the eyeball on the side of their heads. Uh, they're being burlesque. The parents are being burlesque constantly by the powers that be, uh, having them do things like, you know, tell them that the, the coronavirus knows when you're eating a cheeseburger and not in a pub. But this is it. See, I, I was very suspicious when the... You'll see the other video. It's very suspicious. Sorry, I was just eating a scone. Lovely one too. Uh, I was very suspicious when I saw the tide... Well, first, initially, the water broker challenge. Because that, that's painful to pour cold water on yourself and put it on the screen. Then the tide the tide pod challenge. There was, that was like a test run to see just how stupid and susceptible the normies say uh, you are and it was adults who were doing that as well remember and now this ghosting thing following they're already have been humiliated on a grand scale with the rona lot the rona protocols and so on but this is incredible putting a sh putting a sheet on yourself and lying in the middle of the road and hope you know hoping a car doesn't hit you you see this is this is this is i this is probably the same people or similar group a dark gnostic group that's behind the blood over intent thing to get idiots to kill themselves and then harvest the energy from their suffering actually it's better if they don't kill themselves because the suffering is actually better if they end up with enormous spinal injuries they can harvest that energy forever and uh, things like that and so this is what we're dealing with today this is what's out there these are these are the children of the ones telling you to stay at home save lives maintain social distancing and the re this is their children they're, they're, they're in, like they see their parents who are incapable of resisting suggestion uh, given to them. They're totally easily burlesqued. So they look at their parents and subconscious, their subconscious mind sees, sees Pop with the two gloves on him going, oh, the eyeball on the side of the head and the mask and, the, and all the fred by the Rona. And that father figure is now a failure. He's, he's, he's a frightened little man. And it's protect, particularly to their younger, their, their coming of age children. Uh, teenage kids their father is now a terrified frightened ninny and he's no use as a father figure
Okay, that would have been the thing in the past. And then those kids would become runaways and things like that. But nowadays, the burlesquing is everywhere. It's the grand, like, la grand burlesque, you know. And this is just, we'll see a lot more of these kinds of things. There's a, the normies are so, you, you, you could get them to eat their own shit at the moment and put it on video. This is what we're dealing with now. This is how witchcraft start, witch hunt started. And this is how uh, the Nazis started. This is how the Bolsheviks started. Keep making the population and keep humiliating them and burlesquing them. And eventually they cannot think for themselves. And they will do literally anything. So the, the powers that be see these idiots putting themselves on the road because of this ghosting fad. And then they think, well, we have to make once they'll do, they'll do something else now. And this is what we're dealing with. This is what we're dealing. This is why you can never wake these people up. You know, the parallel society going forward, and we'll see a lot more of this as we enter the, the end of the Kali Yuga, which I'm convinced is happening between now and 2026, and probably according to some some gurus have ended about started about 2016. But we're on it now, and these are, these things are part of it. In the past, you may have had daredevil things. You know, but there was something particularly strange about the eating of the Tide Pod, a detergent pod, this kind of thing. And if you can get them to do that, that was probably the test run for the masks and the Rona and everything else like that. And this is what we're dealing with. This is what you're dealing with. These are the people you will never wake up. So check out the video on Blood Over Intent on the, the link below. And uh, I'll also post the journal.e article. And uh, just be amazed and be glad that you're not one of these things. See us, bye.